Link settings allow you to create and manage web links that you can share with your stakeholders and get feedback on your design. To share a specific flow, you'll want to begin by selecting the first artboard in the sequence and then to the left of it clicking on the home icon. I'm getting ready to test two different landing pages for a mobile website, so here in the prototype mode, I'm going to define two different flows for two different prototypes. I'll go ahead and name this first flow test1, and I want to define a second flow, so I'll click here, define home for that, and we'll call this test2. When I switch over to share mode, I can select either of the flows I've just defined and then set the appropriate link settings. Notice in the link area, XD has gone ahead and adopted the name that I used when I created the flow. I can always override it or just keep it the same. In view settings, I can select which of the view options I'd like for my stakeholder. Selecting custom shows me all of those options and allows me to select what I'd like. I can roll back up to user testing for this example, and when I roll over the information icon, it lets me know which of these view options will be used. From here, I can set security around the link I'm creating by adding a password if I'd like, or for even greater security, inviting my stakeholders using their Adobe ID. In order to view the design, they'd need to log in using their Adobe account. And that's a quick review of the link settings in action.